Tyrannosaurus rex is one of the most well-known and famous dinosaurs. It's been featured in countless books and movies, which is why it's no surprise that we're doing it for our first Fossil of the Week episode. Hi everyone, my name is Hunter Schrader. I'm with Black Hills Institute here. Right now we're in the collection room underneath the museum, and we were going to do Fossil Fridays for these videos, but alliteration is for amateurs. But what I got for you guys right here is one of my favorite specimens we have, which is Foxy Lady. Now Foxy Lady here, what we've got is the lower dentary or lower jawbone of a Tyrannosaurus rex. Now Tyrannosaurus rex lived at the end of the Cretaceous period. Its name literally means Tyrant King, and it really was the Tyrant King of its time. It lived alongside dinosaurs such as Edmontosaurus, Triceratops, and a lot of other really famous ones. Now let's look at Foxy Lady specifically here. So what we've got here is a little bit more of a close-up of Foxy Lady's lower jawbone. Something I want to point out here is that you can kind of see right here there's a tooth that hasn't quite erupted yet. And we can compare that with this one here that is fully erupted. Now to better demonstrate this, we have this visual model that we have created here. You can see right there, there's the tooth that hasn't quite erupted, just like that one down there, and there's the ones that have. Now T-Rex teeth tell us a lot about the animal, and T-Rex teeth are a lot more common than full skeletons, so there are a lot more of them. In fact, some of Foxy Lady's teeth are actually so good that they are on display in the museum. So that's all we have about Foxy Lady right now, but you may be wondering, where am I? I'm in one of the collection rooms underneath our museum here, and it's actually one of several dozen in multiple buildings. So you can see we have a lot of fossils to get to. And we're going to go through one a week, and I actually don't even know what's in most of these because they've been collected over 50 years. And I don't know if you guys guessed this, I'm not 50, so I was not here when most of them were collected. So I'm very excited to show you guys this. Make sure you like and subscribe so you can see all the fossils we're going to bring you guys. Lots of really cool stuff. Thank you all for watching. We'll catch you next time.